Greetings. Welcome back to Nebzido. We are again in the desert. In this case, we are over here in, well, still called Scoring Science, but it's a special place. Let's talk to Mishif. Look at this. To think such an intriguing place was hidden beyond the storm. A relic from the old days of Kedjistan, maybe. Lost to time until Elias seized it. He must have stole some treasure, eh? Mashif, don't move. Don't speak to anyone. There is great danger lurking here. You've grown fearful in your old age, my friend. But worry not. I will stay put. Hmm. Let's just hope this dude stays alive because he is kind of cool. And he still needs to talk to Deckard, right? Deckard! <laughs> Alright. Then to join his anointed circle? <laughs> that one in rags will never survive what is to come. Hoi. That is kind of weird. So there are other people here. I actually thought it was full of demons or something like that. But okay. Actually, a very nice place. I mean, it, ooh. More loot. More loot is good. Dum, 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 dum. What happened just now? Hmm. Lightning. It was Master Elias' hand that brought Lilith to sanctuary, and it will be his hand that binds a lesser evil to our will. Imagine when we hold that kind of power. Hmm. Imagine it backfiring. Why can't I talk to him again? Like he. That's weird. There should be a dialogue box still displayed. I heard the calling in a dream. I saw an army at the mother's side. Ready to wage war against hell. And I was among her followers. Reborn anew with her power. It's kind of weird. They just talk. But you don't really click on them for this. That is kind of strange. Is there a new option in here in sounds that we just don't know? Like, uh... No. Maybe gameplay or something? No. Nope, there's no such thing. Weird, 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 nonetheless. Let's see, maybe we can find a few more. No. Oh, and it's not that talkative, of course. Now then, up we go. Hmm. And again, it's a strange triangular thing pointing us. Oh, that's why. It's the mark of Lilith. Interesting. You there? Wait. What do you mean? I haven't seen you before. We just made it through the storm. By the Mother's grace. Ah, new disciples. You've come at an auspicious time. Lilith recently graced us with her presence. She was here. Oh, it was magnificent. But do not worry. Perhaps Master Elias will give you a glimpse of her through the sightless eye. If he deems you worthy, go inside and present yourself to him. Hmm. That's weird. Why is it that there are no demons around? I mean, we've seen tons of demons everywhere where Lilith arrived, but this one is fairly safe. Exalted Talus. Let's get in there. Damn. This is worse than I thought. Elias has the sightless eye. It's ancient magic. He can see anywhere with it. Across time, even. Hmm. Our flock has grown. Behold, the wonders that the mother has in store for you. 
And the big question is, uh, does it actually help you change the future if you can see across time, or does it just show everything? Okay, I mean, for now, it is fairly peaceful, but let's see what happens afterwards. Maybe the demons are just playing along, or, or maybe they are kind of friendly, like the, uh, mer yeah, like the, the, like the merchant that we found. Hmm. A good old merchant. Yeah, that was actually one of the coolest characters so far. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Mother. Bless me with your power. And whatever you ask of me, it will be done. Hmm. <laughs> Demons and demons and demons, and they're always summoning succubi, of course. Why not? <laughs> hey. And another one. Let's just hope it does not backfire, right? But still, an awful lot of death around. Hmm. And they can try to summon as much as they want, but hmm, let's hope it goes well. Go forth and stand in judgment before Master Elias, but show no fear. No hesitation. Don't worry. We won't. Hmm. But if he sees all across time, right, then he knows that we are in front of the door. So. Okay. Master of the Triune. Okay, there's another door. What's so special about door number three, though? Hmm. Elias. I knew you would come, Laura. Been spying on us with a sightless eye, have you? Do you think I would waste such magic on you? You're still just as narrow-minded as the day I left you. I will put you out of your misery, old man. Alright. Oh, look at this. Awful lot of damage already happened. And... He didn't even... What the... You should have should... stayed in that little cabin, hoarding your regrets. Why is he getting all of that damage, by the way? Is it just Laura? Something deals a ton of damage. I don't know what. I'm not doing anything, by the way. I'm just standing there, waiting. This is over. Mm -hmm. We should find the sightless eye while we still have time. We can't leave it with these fanatics. That was a very interesting boss fight. I see something. Well then... Uh, 
Mephisto, Diablo, Bale. Another vision. Lilith thinks the prime evils will destroy Sanctuary, and she's empowering people to stand against them. That's why she and Elias are gathering followers. They're building a bloody army. Yes, Laura. The Lords of Hell threaten our existence. Oh, yeah. We are doing something about it. Elias. How are you still alive? You will never understand what I have done for this world. Okay. Same procedure as before, by the way. We just stand here and wait. Let's see if I can tank this boss again. Oh no, I'm terrified. Oh no. Does it look like he's regenerating? Look at that. What is it? No, it just looks weird. One thing that you shouldn't have done is get closer because that triggers my regeneration. That was a weird boss fight. Let's just wait a little bit longer. We are halfway there. Let's see. Uh, I'm not moving by the way, that was just the fear. That's not good. Don't want to do this accidentally. I'm not moving. Okay, I'm not commanding anything right now. I'm just standing here. Doing nothing. It's not I that does anything. That's the check behind it. All right, now how much longer? Well, maybe it's Laura that does all of the damage. I don't know. Where's Laura right now? No, Laura attacks the other one. It's only wolves and ravens and creepers attacking. Ah, that's actually pretty decent. Pretty decent. Wow. I'm impressed by how strong these dudes are. Unbelievable. Okay, just a few more seconds and we got it. Wait a minute, there's another boss. Uh, that's weird. 
Oh, well, he's dead. We can't keep bashing our heads against him like this. He'll wear us down. We need to escape, but Wait. not without the Cypress Eye. If we can take it, that'll rob him of some power at least. The thing is, no one is bashing anything in. Just saying. We just stood there doing absolutely nothing. Okay, the gospel of the mother. In the mountains, the mother and I saw a village. The people, cold and hungry, prayed to a light that would give them no warmth. But in her presence, a new fire was stoked in their hearts. They would never go hungry or feel cold again. Okay, I've heard that one before. Hmm. But it might just be an illusion of the senses, right? Ignoring the cold does not get rid of the cold. Hmm. Onwards. Let's see if we can actually fight Elias without even lifting a finger. <laughs> uh, that would be kind of funny. I didn't even notice that I'm so tanky. Actually, when it comes to tankiness, I'm not even that tanky right now. And uh, this one is just... Your core skills deal more damage. But I'm not doing any core skill stuff. I could just equip this and get even more tanky. <laughs> uh, what I need is like um, skill damage bonuses. Actually, yes, skill damage. Skill damage means all of the skills get better. So this one has to be placed up here. Uh, so that everything just gets better. And hopefully that also includes the wolves and so on. Sense the blood of Lilith in you, Wanderer. You received her blessed communion. Open your heart to her. Embrace your nature. Never. Mm -hmm. So our barrier is still there. Oh, fortify may increase. You will give up at some point. It's what you always do. They are running away again because fear. I just stand there. Oh, look at the damage! Look at that. But I have to get closer so that the thorns actually trigger something. It's interesting that our barrier is almost permanently active. Why? Damaging an elite enemy grants you a barrier. Mm. Absor absorbing up to some damage. Damage for 10 seconds. And this effect can only happen once every 30 seconds. I don't know about the cooldown of this. Mm. Either it starts a little early. Oh, 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 oh. We need to do something special. Hmm. Now the question is, can the wolves also solve that problem for me or not? Because this wolf is just standing there. That wolf attacks the enemy right there. Uh, I think we actually have to move just a little bit. So, let's get us in position again. Maybe. An old book. It's always old books, right? <laughs> so, let's move on forward. 
Uh, it's just absolutely amazing how tanky we are. <laughs> so surprising. But it's only this kind of enemy, right? Every other enemy pretty much gets us to our knees. Wait. Uh, it might be because of a nice coincidence with our defenses. Where is it? Yes. A nice coincidence. The shadow resistance is at 70%. Uh, poison is 30, lightning at 50, cold also at 70 or whatnot, and fire is at 30. And he is probably doing a lot of shadowy uh, damage, which is getting reduced a lot. So, would he deal, uh, like, what was it? Would he deal poison or fire damage? Uh, the whole thing would end a little bit differently. And especially if they're like... It is too late to stop what Lilith has begun. Yeah, and as I said, uh, especially if there is like fire explosion uh, enemies, the ones that detonate right next to you, like these could probably kill me. Not probably, I know that they will, but... As long as we stay calm. Actually! What I need is the increase your damage for as long as you stand still. By so much percent. That would be quite helpful. Okay. The wolves have to uh, attack this one here. They kind of recognize that the enemy is immune a bit too late, though. And then there's another one up here. So, and then we can fight him again. Hmm. Oh no, wait a minute. This one has stages now. Let's see. You can do better than this, can't you? Come on. Okay, first stage done. <laughs> Everything is maxed out. The only thing that's missing is a barrier. And there it is. Mm. Alright, we got one third roughly of health done for. Just need to wait a teensy means a bit longer. I just want to test it out. Only on this enemy, by the way. Any other future enemy, I'm just going to smash. Smash to pieces. Alright, come on. We are halfway there. And he's immune again. Maybe the wolf... Yeah, Loloth can uh, take care of the uh, supplicants. We're just going to stand here. That's uh, one of them occupied. But what about the rest? Oh, that was a rather magic. And that was a lightning. Funny bit is actually the uh, random lightning that occurs every so often and whoops. Oh look at this, he's... I didn't even do any uh, like tanky stuff, like there was no slow happening or nothing. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, I'm actually taking damage, look at that. Alright. 
No. How good is the AI to figure out that... Oh, 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 the fire. See? Fire is deadly to us. That's something that we need to take care of. All right. Another one of those. Oh, again. It gets critical. Ah, okay. There are too many of those uh, fiery dudes. That is absolutely not good. If another one of those kills me, that I am absolutely dead. So my guess was correct. All of this is like uh, immune. What? Oh no, he's immune. Uh, And another one. A lot of damage. Those explosive things are just the meanest enemies in the whole game, really. You don't expect them to be so deadly. Anything else you can manage except for this stuff. But okay, except for this one potion that we used. There you go. Now what's he dead? For reals? Oh, another gospel. All right, let's read that one. The mother sat with me at the fire and opened my mind to secret knowledge. Taught me the true names of all demons through which they can be controlled. Once we were the lambs and demons were the wolves, but no more. We, the weak, will be made strong. We, the Chosen, will become the Wolves. Mm -hmm. How is it that the real name of something seems to control them? We heard her. Here it is. The Sightless Eye. Mashif can help us get the artifact far from this place. But we need to hurry before Elias returns. That opening over there is our best chance of escape. Hmm. It's actually a nice shield. <laughs> Alright. The fight would have been over, by the way, in a few seconds. Just say. But no. We had to pretend that we are a god or something. And also, it may only work. Okay, what is. Uh yeah, look at that. Okay, can't look to talk to those people. They don't seem to notice anything, which is great. Put pressure here. We need to stop the bleeding. What? No. I've lost a step in my old age, eh, What happened? No. Hey, <laughs> you made it. Did you kill that sorcerer fellow? Don't talk. The storm was broken. We'll get you out of here. Oh, it's a shame. <laughs> I got mine. Just a hair too late. Sneaky devil poked me in the back. <laughs> Skewered like a quill rat. So it goes. Hey, dear God. Bye. So it goes. They'll be coming. I'm taking the sightless eye. We need a safe place to study it. Use it against them. We'll meet at the desert chapel. Go. Oh, just like that. <laughs> hmm. I have news of Elias. Uh, 
Uh huh. He was just here. I mean, did you kill him? More than once, in fact. Trouble is, he won't stay dead. <laughs> he is more powerful than I thought. I underestimated him. So did I. But we took something important from him, at least. The sightless eye. I think he was using it to commune with Lilith from afar. A powerful piece of magic. And dangerous. Perhaps we can use it to our advantage. Give me some time to study it. The prime evils were reforming. Hell was coming. But Elias was not the answer to anyone's prayers. If you want to take the measure of someone, you judge them by their deeds, not their words. Simple as that. Elias preached of saving the world while standing atop a mountain of corpses. Then there was the Wanderer. Everything Elias was not. Tainted by Lilith's blood and yet able to resist her corruption. That was what I witnessed in the Wanderer's deeds. And that was when I started to think that perhaps together, we could keep the evil at bay. <sighs> Must have been gruesome in that cult of his. No more gruesome than the rest of Sanctuary's underbelly. Oh, I actually got some nice stuff afterwards. Small charms and amulets sank from the old... The weapon of an adventurer who has traveled to the far ends of the world. Sheaf sword. Too bad, it's not good. Now, replentant regalia, tainted with the power of the corrupt, which permeates the very fibers of its fabric and threads, may serve as an integral part of the ceremonial dress of the Primus. Also, close, but not good enough. And usually, what happens is that there is a. Was that the act or. That was the wrong button. Yeah, the next one is Act 4, The Prying Eye. But there's definitely a few more side quests available now, is it? And maybe even... Uh, other dungeons? Oh, yeah, and this one here. There is... Hmm, that still has to be uncovered. But to be honest, uh, we are... Ah, there we have it. Uh, the Act 3 has everything, kind of, uh, to do with the uh, dry steps. Mm, and that part here somehow also is involved in it and the actual dungeons uh, that got unlocked were the ones up here the Guran camels uh, the forgotten depth and uh, this one up here the dark ravine interesting so um, let's just talk to them real quick so that we don't have to go here again maybe we can meet them somewhere else I'm sorry we couldn't save Machine. He deserved better. Damn it. I brought him into this. Hmm. And like Elias, the cathedral believes the prophecies about Inarius. Of course. Their entire faith hinges on it. Inarius is the spear that will pierce hatred's heart. The knight's penitent to the weak made strong. Prava is the mother who will mold the new age from the ashes. They found a way to weave themselves into every part of it. Hmm. Interesting. Where did the sightless eye come from? It's a relic from when the world was young. For many years, an order of rogues called the Sisters of the Sightless Eye kept it safe. Not sure how they lost hold of it. But I've heard the Sisters are not as strong as they once were. Knowledge of their craft has spread to others. But most rogues you see these days are not true members of the order. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Feeling better, Taisha. I can shut out Andario's whispers most of the time. But not always. Better a whisper than having her walk the world again. Andario is part of Lilith and Elias's plan. But how? What do we know so far? Lilith made a deal with Astaroth. Hmm. The demon who served her father. Interesting choice of ally. And uh, she has a key to hell. A place where she's seen as a traitor. So why would she go? And is she already there? 
We need answers. Elias used the sightless eye to contact Lilith. Perhaps it can help us. Bring it here, would you? It's risky, but we haven't got a choice. Let's see. More dexterity might be good, but I think I got... Yeah, I got all of it that I needed down here. Now I just go for... Vulnerable damage, maybe. That could help. Do I have some percentage damage? 5%. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, let's just spread it out. Before I'm going to completely reskill it. When you're ready, picture Lilith in your mind and gaze into the eye. My father's essence is reforming. How do you know? I feel it like a thousand old wounds ripped open again. He is still weak, vulnerable. I must strike before he can resist. Make his power yours. The other lords will. we're looking for her. Only a matter of time before she comes after us. Not necessarily. What do you mean? Mephisto is reforming. And Lilith aims to take his power while he is still weak. So, that's what you'd be preparing for. She takes Mephisto's power. She'll become like a prime evil herself. She'll be able to conquer hell and sanctuary alike. I have an idea how to stop her. But for it to work, we'll need the help of an old ally. Deliver this message to Dolan. He'll have gone to Kyobushan for guidance. Ooh. Fi. Uh, Lee. Okay. So, what do you know of Andariel? More than I care to know. Her pain is primal. Wordless. Once, she was part of something more. Ugh. She doesn't like me to think on it. Hmm. If Lilith consumes Mephisto, could it help Sanctuary? It would strike a blow against Hell, that much is certain. But is it really for our benefit, as she claims? All her actions are driven by hatred. That is her nature, and she can never change it. Hmm. You're saying she has plans beyond protecting humanity? I'm saying it's impossible to know. She can peer into heart, tell us what we want to hear. You've seen it with Donan, Elias and others. To trust her would mean gambling with the fate of all humankind. Not a risk I'm willing to take. Hmm. What did you write in that letter? The beginnings of a plan to thwart Lilith. One thing's for sure, we need a soul stone. And that means we need Donan. He'll understand when you deliver the letter. Oh. I'm gonna use Astaroth's soul stone. Are we going to get another one this time? But okay. We are... 
going to finish the unlocked dungeons in the dry desert before we are going anywhere closer to Kyolashar. The nice thing is these... Hmm. Wanted to say all of those dungeons, but... Uh, yeah, okay, that one is actually a bit further away than expected. That one is the only one closest to a teleporter, but alright. Anyway, we're going to do some dungeons in the next episode, which means uh, right now we are going to end it. A little bit of um, inventory management. Uh, well, they would kind of burn the last few minutes of the episode. Pretty much overdid it already. Anyhow, until next time, then like and subscribe and uh, goodbye. Ta ta.